That fear is a dream killer But my fears are failing Made me dream bigger So big Some would say It's just a fantasy What's up guys Um I just got home from work Figured I'd give you an update Um Yes I still vape um, it is currently winter out, so I don't really have anything planned for this winter, um, so I mean, I'm probably going to be doing reviews on this, I just picked up my new one, it's currently charging right now, um, my K4, the one that I actually quit smoking cigarettes with, that Honestly, if you're going to try and quit smoking, I would honestly go and get that in a heartbeat. It cost me $50, and then I ended up getting an upgraded bottle of juice, which is $5 extra charge. It was the uh, K4 starter kit. It was honestly the best babe that I had and used constantly um i went through a few coils obvious um but this um this is the cool fire ultra as you guys can see it has the valerian uh sub ohm tank which is actually pretty good um the only downfall about this tank is it only comes with a 1.5 ohm coil kind of eh. I wish it came with either a lower or higher to get better flavor out of it but it does come with I don't know if you can see the green o-rings oh, let's take that off the green o-rings you can actually change out it comes with red ones but I changed it out for the green. I don't know why, I just wanted green. Typical 510 tip. Um, the cool thing about this tank is instead of it, like you're twisting it off, it's got a button, right? My camera would focus. I can find it right here. This button will actually pop this up and you can fill it. It does have two small slots to fill it. And then all you do after you fill it is you just snap it back. And it's honestly, it's a really good bait for um, the money. Mind you, I miss the original tank that came on this. I absolutely loved it. Um, the tip that was on it actually stripped out it was plastic I, I could have bought another tank that was meant for this but I wanted to go with this one there weren't that many reviews when I bought it so um got your typical display um at 110 watts I get the best flavor out of it I'm probably yeah, I'm probably like a third of the way open on the air. I mean, you got it. So it'll be fully closed off and it'll stop. Turn it the other way, you're fully open. Um, I personally like it when it's third quarter of the way open. So I like that restriction. I don't know why. It's just... It feels better. It tastes better. Um, but yeah, I do have my other babe. It's currently charging. I had to reset it. It wouldn't charge without it, me resetting it. Um, but yeah, this is the Inoken Cool Fire Ultra. Great. 
I absolutely love this. Wouldn't ask for anything better. Um, I'm just getting into this, so if you see anything wrong the way I'm doing it, just let me know. Um, but yeah. Let's sit back a little. It's not bad. Um, it's currently winter out where I live. So, that's why I haven't been doing anything car related. Kind of sucks, but, um, I however did start carrying more product, um, I'm a sales rep for V Raceworks down in Hudson Valley, New York. And honestly, they carry so much more parts. They carry Carbon Creation, Saibon, Megan Racing, BC Racing, um, D2, uh, basically anything. So, I mean, I understand this is a vapor review, but. I just figured I'd throw that out there for you guys. There will be Black Friday sales. Don't you guys worry. You guys know where to find me. Diverse on Facebook. or Well, Diverse FRS on Facebook. Or on Instagram. Same thing. Diverse underscore FRS. So. Um, but yeah, I've been vaping on this for this battery for probably... Two months now and I absolutely love it doesn't need any updates um, it's kind of abused I got a chip missing out of it right here I got a scratch right here which is kind of hard to see um, I just want my other vape to charge honestly um, I do have to replace the coil on it I bought it used, I bought it off a buddy at work, he quit vaping, and sold it to me, like I said, it is currently, I don't know, it's probably like 1.30, almost 2 in the morning, figured I'd give you guys a little, like, update, um, the vape juice that is in this is actually from unique e-cigs i don't buy my stuff online because the last my last experience with that i didn't it didn't go so well i got sick and my order got fucked up the flavor was off um i'm vaping on fishtails it tastes just like sweetest fish as you guys can tell i am currently out of it but that's why i always buy two this is uh blackberry Literally, it tastes just like Jolly Ranchers. Um, it don't smell like Jolly Ranchers. Um, but besides that, I absolutely love this setup that I have. Now, if I lost this or misplaced it or it broke, would I go out and buy it again? Yes, but I'd be more... Um, I wouldn't use this tank on this battery. I'd use a different tank. I don't know. I'm trying to expand my vape um, collection, honestly. Which is going to be good, I hope. Um, currently vaping on, like I said, the fishtails. I think it's 0.3 for nicotine. Yeah, 0.3 for nicotine. It is a 3070 PG VG. So, I can't really pick and choose the size bottles that I get about the PG VG. Um, but besides that, I mean, if you guys want, I'll go get the other vape for you right now. Alright, I'm back. So, um, I ended up buying this off my friend at work, and honestly, 
have to turn down the wattage because that is way too much for this. Probably, it's at 44% charge right now. Um, I put it up to 110 watts, which is what this one is. At, like I said, I have to buy a new coil for the big baby beast tank. So. Alright, so what I ended up actually buying from him was the smock. G150 and honestly I've never used it so this is actually a first for me and let's see how it do, does at 44% battery um honestly never use this battery I've seen rip chippers review on this battery so charge this up a little bit more. I locked it. Um, I'm going to actually go charge that battery some more. And then I will get back to you with that guy with that smart G150 and the big baby bees in another video. But I'm out. And, yep. So, I mean, it seems like this battery dies pretty quick. So, which kind of sucks, but it's whatever. I'm gonna drop it down to 95 watts. It's at 95 watts on this battery, so I'm gonna actually go and charge it right now, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right.